it KP Skin Ham. Cooking with KP and today I'm going to show you how I make my UFO burgers. UFO you ask? Yeah, you'll see as we go along. Look, let's just get on with it. Right, here I've got 500 grams of ground beef or beef mince and I'm seasoning that up nice and heavily with some salt, black pepper and white pepper. About equal amounts of each. I want a really good tasty peppery flavor to this and the salt just brings out the flavor of the beef so i've put it in giving it a little bit of a stir and i've put the rest in i've used about three teaspoons in total of all so get your gloves on mix it all up nice and we're going to make up some even sized little meatballs just like this now here's a quick tip i normally use like an 80 20 split with my meat and that's like 20 percent fat and, uh, and about 80% beef but uh, here's a really quick tip buy the least expensive beef mince you can and it will work out perfect puff pastry I've got a little ramekin I know I can get four of these ramekins onto this sheet of pastry so it's going to work out perfectly I'm going to maximize the amount of pastry that I have right, so just get your little uh, parry knife run it around like that and we'll end up with some nice little discs of pastry just like that all right i'm going to save you all the agony of me cutting those there we are we've put those down on some baking paper we're going to add in some cheese i'm using a good aussie tasty cheese that just goes straight down on there now a little bit of mustard that can go straight down just as per a burger should be the only other flavor that should be in a burger of course is a little bit of tomato ketchup or tomato sauce as we say here in australia so we can one mustard one tomato ketchup and we can put our beef down like that give him a good little pat Just make sure he's a good little boy okay and we're going to put our lid straight over the top now on a couple of these i did actually add a dill pickle slice and if you don't know how to make dill pickles um, i'll try and leave a link in the description how to make your own if you really want to but what we're going to do is simply pat that patty down a little bit just flatten it out a little bit and what we need to do now is get those edges all together now as you can see it's a little bit sloppy don't worry it's all going to work out in the end and in actual fact by actual mistake we found out that the uh, little bit of mustard and tomato on the top of the pastry works out great so i'm going to crimp that down with the back of a fork just like that very very simple make sure we've got a nice join and they actually look like a little ufo when you're finished so we've got this uh, rounded bottom and rounded top absolutely perfect right there we are we've got all our little burgers sitting there and going to give that a little brush with a bit of egg wash which is just an egg mixed with a little dash of milk or dash of water i'll leave that up to you and give those a little bit of a brush down give that a paint i've also added a little couple of slices in the top little couple of holes and that's going to allow some of the steam to come out now this is basically going to end up being a deconstructed burger so here i've got some uh lettuce just a normal lettuce and i've added a little bit of caesar salad dressing just pre-bought very very simple and we're going to make up our little salad for our burgers a bit of that lettuce a bit of tomato and because i'm aussie we love beetroot on a burger okay you might think it's weird but i'll tell you what the whole thing just works add your little ufo burgers onto the plate just like that and if you want to serve that up with a few uh, fries or chips you can it works out quite nicely but there you go kp's ufo burgers love to see you try and make this one at home it's a lot of fun all right thank you so much for watching this video really do appreciate it and if you like this video hit that like button gives me confidence it should make you feel warm and fuzzy if you don't like this video hey hit that like button because i said so share this video with all your friends on all platforms of social media we're trying to get the name of kp's kingdom out there don't forget to hit that notification bell you'll be notified every time a new video goes up hey leave a comment i love reading and i love responding to them in the meantime if you want to see how i take a fast food favorite and really mess with it like this one well you need to come and join the family my family hit that subscribe button and you'll never miss another one of my videos again i've to eat my ufo burgers and i'm going to enjoy them and i will catch you next time bye